let T be the linear transformation whose standard matrix is given. So we got standard matrix here. Okay, we can call it A. Decide if T is a one-to-one -one mapping. Also decide if T maps R4 onto R4. So we are going to use this theorem. So when we have a mapping T, linear transformation, and A being the standard matrix, then T is one to one, T is one to one, if the columns of A, the matrix R, columns of A are linearly independent. Okay. And T is, so we got four rows and four columns. So in this case, T is mapping R4 to R4. And that R maps on two, okay? If and only if columns of A span Rm, so R4. Okay, any vector in R4 should be can be written as a linear combination of the columns. So for this, uh, we can convert, we can change this matrix into its reduced row each run form, okay? Reduce each run form. And from there, we can conclude in one line. So let me, it's a big, you can do by hand, but it takes a lot of time. So I'm going to use TI-83 calculator, TI-84, same thing, TI-86 and convert this into reduced each learn form or reduced row each learn form so here is the calculator so first up uh, we need to uh, go to the matrix which is second so i need to make it okay turn it on second x inverse that gives you matrix okay now I want to select to edit, go move right. Now number one A is selected, so enter. So we got one by one, but this is a four by four. So we do four, enter, four, enter. Now we have this vector, so we go in this way. Okay, seven, four. And every single time we enter the entry and just enter okay seven enter five enter four enter negative nine enter ten enter six enter sixteen enter negative four enter twelve enter eight enter 12 enter 7 enter now last row negative 8 enter negative 6 negative 2 5 so we edited a matrix and we named that's a or b doesn't matter a now quit second more that's quit now we want to change this into reduced row each learn form so again second x inverse that's the matrix so we are matrix now we want to do math the next tab okay move to the next so math and scroll down one two three four five so you'll see r r e f somewhere this is r e f reduced each learn form, sorry row each learn form next is r r e f so that's enter so r r e f of a so we need to type a I don't know how to type A, but I'm gonna go second X inverse again matrix and I wanna select. One is already selected, so just enter. And don't have to put parentheses, enter. Okay. So we got one zero 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 one zero zero. And then the last row the last row is all zeros. Okay. And here is seven negative nine zero zero, and we got here zero zero one zero. 
so let me write that over here so we got reduced row echelon form using calculator one two three four okay one zero seven zero and second row zero one negative nine zero and third row is zero 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 one so zero 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 one now if we look at closely we got pivot here pivot here oh there is no pivot for third column and pivot here okay there is no pivot in the third column so we if we set this up like ax equals some b something like that then we get infinitely many answers okay so we get infinitely many answers that means if we said ax equals zero let's say this one there is no unique solution okay and that means these columns are not linearly independent okay columns are not linearly independent because this thing this can be this third column can be written as a linear combination of in fact first second and third as you can see if we multiply first column by seven multiply second column by negative nine and plus multiply last by zero and add we get the third column okay so third column is in fact a linear combination of other columns that means the columns are not linearly independent so not one to one so i'm going to write this or you can say in this way if we try to solve ax equals zero that means all zero here we get infinitely many solutions okay so it's not one to one so we can write uh, this t transformation is not is not one to one okay is not one to one okay now again there is no pivot in the last row so we cannot spend anything in everything from r4 if we take like in r4 1 2 3 4 say this is a vector in r4 this vector cannot be represented by a linear combination of these four vectors so one is fine this will be uh, two is also fine and three is also fine from here but look at this this all zeros from this we cannot get four that means t is on to if and only if the columns of a span rm that means in, in our case r4 r4 to r4 no because there is no pivot in the last column so t is not on to r4 to r4 because not every vector in r4 is a linear combination of these columns because if we have non-zero number in the last entry in this vector since we have all zeros we can never get this okay 